Hello folks and welcome to another battery testing video. Today I will be testing AAA batteries and more specifically Energizer Recharge Power Plus which is nickel metal hydride battery rated at 700 milliamps per hour versus Tronic Eco again nickel metal hydride battery which is rated 950 milliamps per hour the energizer is American brand it's manufactured in Japan while the Tronic is a low-cost brand that you can find in Lido the batteries are manufactured in China The two energizer batteries cost 5 euros while the four Tronic costs only 3.5 euros. So if uh, the Tronic really manages to provide the 950 milliamps per hour it's rated, it will be a real bargain. I will be testing the batteries with my smart battery charger discharger if you haven't watched my previous videos this device is programmed to discharge the batteries until they reach 0.9 volts when a battery reaches that threshold the device automatically starts to charge it so I will be monitoring the whole process and we'll be writing down the battery voltage, the elapsed time and of course the milliamps per hour the battery manages to provide. So first let's unpack the batteries, let's open the energizer. Let's see if we have some place manufacturing date. Unfortunately, I do not see such. Okay, never mind. Now, let's open the Tronic Do we have some manufacturing date? Again, I don't see such. I've changed a little bit the shooting ground so I can be closer to a power outlet. Now let's power the device and see the battery's initial voltage. It's pretty equal. Now let's power up again and select the discharge mode discharge now let's select the highest available discharge current that's 350 milliamps and wait for the process to start it started you can observe the voltage of each of the battery the milliamps per hour it managed to provide the elapsed time and the discharge current after one hour and 41 minutes this is the condition of the batteries
the voltage again is pretty equal they all manage to provide 573 milliamps per hour we have some development on the discharge process and it seems that this energizer will be the first discharge battery after 726 milliamps per hour 2 hours and 8 minutes so let's see how much longer it will last Seven twenty-eight milliamps per hour for this energizer. Two hours and eight minutes. And it seems to deliver it its rated capacity of seven hundred milliamps per hour. Now we are left with the second energizer and the two Tronic Eco, which are going quite head to head. And not long after, the second energizer will go out of the race also. 736 milliamps per hour, 2 hours and 10 minutes. Yes. Seven thirty nine milliamps per hour, two hours and ten minutes. And it seems that the two Tronic Eco are quite better than the two energizers. After two hours and nearly thirty minutes, their voltage is one point zero seven volts, and they managed to provide nearly 850 milliamps per hour unfortunately I will have to leave the house so I will shut down the device without actually checking how much more they can manage to provide but we will definitely do another test to verify if they can match the 950 milliamps they are rated at so bye for now guys and thumbs up